لا الفرش الحديث ولا الديكور المعاصر سر اختيار هذه الشقة لتكون جزءا من أذواق مصمم ديكور داخلي تحدى القوالب الجاهزة وحول جراج سيارات إلى شقة سكنية تتماشى مع أسلوب حياته وهواياته الخاصة كالطهو وقضاء الوقت في المطبخ It was boxing concrete. I had to do some openings and introduce natural light uh, uh, and uh, put into it the story that I would like to live in it. I had to introduce uh, some signs of uh, nature. Uh, so I had to do these openings. The challenge was how it can become a livable space without feeling that we are in a, in a closed box. So we tell everyone's story in this house. It, it should have a scenario and we live inside this scenario. المساحة المظلمة تحولت عبر فتحة في جدار إلى شقة بامتداد خارجي تمنح ساكنها شرفة مفتوحة على السماء We train ourselves for a mode of a living, for a way of a living. When we go to the streets, I mean, you know, it's, it's a chaos outside Cairo. When you come in, you need certain order, you need certain uh, serenity, you need, uh, uh, you need certain logic and system to follow and to, to, to live with. My lifestyle is that I receive a lot of people. I have my friends, they come, I cook, uh, we do gatherings, we, uh, uh, so it's around the table, the heart of the house. كل متطلبات السكن من غرفة جلوس وطعام وغرفة نوم ومطبخ وحمام اتسعت لها المساحة بحكم خبرة وذوق وتوزيع متقن للمفروشات واللوحات. والذكريات العائلية. I was really trying not to design the house. It was just a space, the materials, lighting, texture, and above all, the most important was how to reflect a way of life. Why we can't? Uh, have uh, our uh, washing basins inside the room and it has to be inside the bathroom and closed in with walls and I mean there is no more limits